Why did she just say that? <laughs> Why did she just say that? We secured the goods. He's <laughs> 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 got great. Like. <laughs> Hello little chickens Welcome or welcome back to my channel So we have the TV on the wall Pictures on the wall Progress I'm, I'm liking wearing my hair like this I wore my hair like this yesterday right And I like it It's just like butterfly clipped up I feel like one of the cute little Pinterest girls First things first <laughs> This was the wine that we got at um, Costco in the last video. And it's actually very good. So, don't mind Lily, with her nose strip on. Today, our video has a sponsor. Everybody say yeah, yeah. So today's video, I'm so excited about this sponsorship actually because I have been using this service, I don't even know how long. Months and months and months and months. I started doing it last year because like I lead a busy life and trying to think of things to cook at night time is a myth, but I still want to eat good. I still want to eat like healthy. I still want to get on my nutritious food inside me, but I just don't have the time to go shop, think about what I'm going to cook, do it like, it's not for me. So today's sponsor of our video is HelloFresh. <laughs> Why am I talking like a children's TV host? Hello Fresh! Yay! Everybody say woo! I have used HelloFresh for the longest time. I love it. And so I'm so excited that today's video is sponsored by HelloFresh. And I thought maybe you can um come with me as I'm gonna cook a delicioso meal. So so let's cut to when I receive my parcel and how you receive it and some more info about HelloFresh. And I'll do that and edit in. I'll put that in. In. Hello Fresh delivers quality fresh food right to your doorstep without any of the hassle of going to the shops and giving you no waste as everything is pre-portioned out for you. Every meal has a recipe card with all the instructions and all the ingredients come in a bag ready for you to use. I've had so many amazing meals on Hello Fresh and it's honestly given me the opportunity to eat delicious food but give me the convenience of having no hassle at all. So I have a code that you can use, it's Emma50 for 50% off your first box and 35% off the next three boxes. That's Emma 50 is on the screen right now. Try it out and see how you like it. Today, we're gonna cook. It was a toss up between the pan fried monkfish and creamy tagliatelle, which literally looks so fucking bougie. I feel like we should eat that tomorrow night, you know, Friday night dinner. Um, but tonight, we're doing crispy chicken with chili and chive sauce. That sounds like it's, I've had something similar to this before from HelloFresh. Anytime, anytime I get a chicken dish, it's so good because the way they tell you to cook it, and it's the thing like, I like to think I'm a chef, but I don't really know what I'm doing. So when they tell me exactly what to do in the times, it's so useful because the chicken always turns out juicy and crispy and mwah. It seems like a pretty simple one. It's, it's a 20 minute rapid dish with a little bit of spice. And our ingredients are as follows. We are in bag 23. So, let me show you the ingredients. Potatoes, spinach, chives, a chili pepper, chicken stock paste. And then in the fridge, we should have chicken breast fillet skin on and some creme fraiche. And also some garlic right here. So that's all the ingredients that we need. This is gonna take 20 minutes, so I'm just gonna let you watch me, to be honest. I always fold the bag over, like, and then I put my rubbish in the bag. Little hack for you. Let's get cooking, and I'll do a little nice little montage that you can enjoy with me. <laughs> Can you 
This is not my best presentation, let's face it, but I'm not chicken juice because I put the chicken juice on top. But here is our dinner. I mean, I know it's going to taste good because I already tasted the sauce and everything like that. You're waiting to put mayo on, aren't you? Go on, put your mayo on. This is our dinner. We're going to eat it and I'll let you. Oh no, sorry, I need to put some chives on. You ready? This display. A little bit of chive. Yeah. So, we'll eat this and we'll let you know our verdict mm -hmm. at the end. I'm excited. I'm feeling very excited. Ding. <laughs> Do you want me to take my airpods and we can share one each? No, I ain't got a mask. Have you got one? Yeah. <laughs> Hi. So, me and Liliana, she's in her bedroom. We're gonna go on a walk, but we're not going on a Well, we are going on a walk. I basically want to get my steps in. I'm not left the house today. And I also want to go to Selfridges, so we're gonna walk to Selfridges. Bit of a trek, but it is what it is. But we're in, both in weird moods, aren't we? Yo. My God, look at her fucking reflective. Can you see me? Won't lose you in the dark, will we now? All right, so yeah. we're both in weird moods. We're both going to Selfridges. We're going on a walk. We're going to gossip. It's going to be a good time. Maybe we can do, I don't know, do summer. We're not going out for, we're not going to sit outside and have tea, are we now for no. that? Because I've got a sea bass. So we might. Might stop for a bevy, beverageino, <gasps> maybe a coffee, I don't know. You're getting ripped tonight, R.I.P. that pussy. Yeah. <laughs> hey, how you feel, how you feel, how you feel? 25 sitting on 25 mil, yeah. I'm in the building and I'm feeling myself. Hey, hey, well, I don't want to have a ass top. My team, well, we don't really need a mess up. One, time for one time. Grand Almost drowned in the pussy, so I swam for the buddy. <laughs> so... I can't swim because of money in the way. So, it's Saturday. We just had a delicious brunch and it was HelloFresh. I'm gonna insert a nice little video right here. What did you think, Lil? It was beautiful. I really, really enjoyed that. Like, I've never had anything like brunchy from HelloFresh, but it was so good. And I, I don't think I can choose a favorite. So no. it was like pancakes with like creme fraiche mixed with peanut butter and then like a little bit of sugar and like stacked on top of each other and then like these maple baked peanuts and then it was avocado on toast with bacon and balsamic roasted tomatoes and a bit of feta on top oh my god was that the perfect balance, it was it? beautiful and it wasn't too much like i'm not sat here like yeah Ugh. no so we've both we feel, we both feel a bit weird today yeah. so we're like, weird energy going around today i think we should probably like clean the gaffer. Clean. Clean the gaffer and then. Do some bits and bobs. Paolo Santo it. Get rid Stage of the energy. Get bitch. rid of the energy. <laughs> We've decided tonight we're gonna go because the weather outside is diabolical. And like we, there's no reservations for any restaurants or anything. I think we need to start getting reservations when we can yeah. and just booking it and then figuring out the logistics later yeah. of who's gonna go. <laughs> Start book. Yeah. Because yeah. people must literally be booking. That's what they do. That's what they do. We to have go. decided tonight we're going to go to the drive-in cinema. Yeah, baby. We're going to watch Dirty Dancing at the drive-in cinema. So yeah. I really want to do the mm, 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 the rock, paper, scissors where TikTok you, challenge. the TikTok thing where you choose. What did they choose? Was it main? Well, people, some people do drinks, starters, mains and desserts. Oh, I don't, I don't think you lot, need to it? do drinks. I think we should just, no, I, I think we should do drinks. Do you think? Yes, because I've got an idea. <sighs> so it's like, I think we should do drinks. I mean... Do we need a starter? I feel like we're going to be so full. That's Unless, why don't we do drinks, snacks, main dessert. dessert? Yeah, okay. I don't even think we're going to eat the snacks, but we move. I think we should bring our own drinks. I've got what a drink idea. Okay, 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 okay. Right? So drinks, and then what? Um, drinks, mains, desserts, and snacks. Yeah. Okay. I feel, like, I, feel, I feel like both our drinks are going to be the same. No, because I've got something in my head. And I will find it. Oh, I'm scared. Are you scared? So, so this is for drinks. So whoever wins gets to pick Yeah, and we'll write it down. This is for drinks. Yeah. You didn't want to get this right. Let's <laughs> do it. You ready? Ready? 
rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> Wait, what are you doing? <laughs> now I've got to change what I'm doing. It's one, two, three, boom. Yeah. Yeah. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> no, you don't do that. Alright, okay. You ready? I'm scared, right? Rock. Ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <gasps> I win! I win! Not the dream! <laughs> Oh no, I'm probably gonna go lose my job, I'm panicking! <laughs> I'm panicking! Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! You're taking a piss. Ooh. It's because I'm getting distracted filming this. Do you want me to do it? Mm -hmm. Who's hold it? Yeah, you hold it for the next two. <laughs> so, so we do mains again? No, so you're doing mains. Alright. You're No, sorry, yeah, you're choosing the mains. Right. It's a lot I've of pressure. A, I've got a ball game. It's a lot of pressure. All right, now I'm gonna do it again. Imagine if I don't get any right. Okay, you ready? You ready? Ready? Wait, 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 wait. Go. <laughs> Two, three. <laughs> so I'm doing dessert. See, it feels weird when you have to do it at the same time. Yeah. Oh, this is so much pressure. Like, I don't think you understand how I feel now. I feel Why? like I'm on a TV show. So you're you're doing, doing drinks and mains, and I'm doing dessert and snacks. Oh! Ah. I best get thinking. I best get thinking. I've got an idea. <laughs> mm. Yours is easy, bro. Oh! Yours is easy. What, do you want to swap one of them? No. What do you mean it's easy? You've got drinks and main. I'm in position for you. Right, the drinks and the snacks are piss easy, yeah? Piss easy. But... Yeah, but are we talking drinks that are going to last us throughout the whole thing, or are we talking like a, a drink? A drink. Right. Any drink. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Do you want me to tell you what I was going to do if I got drinks? Because I know what you were going to say. What were you going to say? You were going to say something like a slush or a sanguine. Yes, I was. <laughs> yes, I was. How did you know that? Because I can read your mind. No, but you can just get an oasis from the fucking shop. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, that's what I mean. You like drinks. Right, so you, you're picking the mains. You know I eat anything. Do you want to ask this fucking stressed out? <laughs> you have no idea why I've got up my It's easy. Right, now the thing is... What do you mean it's easy? Logically now. Look at me. What? Need to think logically. Yeah. Because are there things that we're going to go and pick up? I mean, probably for me, yes. Right. Well, now I need to think of time frames. Well, that's what exactly why we've done it now. Are you not so happy though now? Don't you feel immediately happier? That was my idea. Fuck off. <laughs> it was. Fuck off. It was. Um. <gasps> oh! 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 You've got a good one. What? For the main? <laughs> I think I'm just bursting vessel in my neck. Behave yourself, darling. <laughs> I've got such a good one. But for your desserts, I feel like I know what one of them's going to be. What? What? What do you think it's going to be? I want to say it. I'm going to say it to the camera, but don't look. I can just go and watch that back. Oh, yeah. <laughs> don't do that. I won't. You're just ruining it. You're <laughs> ruining it. <laughs> if you only knew. Yeah, but you're... <laughs> what? Oh, oh, I know. I know some of your ones. I know. I know you. I know you. You don't, know you. you don't know anything about me. Yeah, I know. You don't you. know the first thing about me. Look away. Let's go over there. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> it's a drink. We're going to go far, you know. You listening? No, I'm, not, I'm actually having a shit. Okay. And um, we're going to go for a water, you know, maybe Diet Coke Fanta, oh, the staples oh, that you have when you're having a meal. Maybe a tango eye splash or, or a slush as well as a as a side treat. For the mains, um, I've got five guys. This is all I've got so far. Um, five guys. Who doesn't want five guys? Piccolino's here in Manchester is beautiful, and me and Em said that we wanted to go, and I think they're doing takeout. So, oh my god, imagine cheesy garlic bread, pasta, lasagna. I'm not gonna pick KFC. She'd probably hate me <laughs> um i'm not gonna do mcdonald's i'm gonna push the boat out we could do 
arches but then i feel like she's picked arch we'll do her desserts in a minute um but yeah so we've got five guys piccolinos there's oh my god what's it called south money flavors here in manchester um that's that's really nice um then there's see there's a really nice chinese place do i go and like just get us like a chinese i just there's so many options and i'm like the most indecisive person so i really need to make my mind up now desserts i feel like i know what she's picked so i feel like she's done cin cinnabon cinnabon i feel like that's one of her options i feel like she's picked arches i feel like she's picked cake factory is it called cake factory um but there's a place in manchester that does these um chocolate covered strawberries but they're like um no nutella covered strawberries and they are amazing we got them once a couple of years ago um they're so nice and they do like a really nice chocolate cake so i feel like they're on her on her menu I feel like this is gonna be the winner um so yeah my outfit is gonna be cup casual might have been going with pjs who knows anyway that is all don't know how to turn this off I'm gonna tell you drinks, and then mains. I've got options. Oh, okay. So because I can't pick, what? You know, because you know I'm so indecisive. So drinks, we'll go with. But wait, you have to, you have to choose the establishment. You know that. What do you mean? Like you're telling me we're going here. Yeah. Yeah. And it's not about ah, uh, like do you want to go here? It's like we're going here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not telling you what drink you're getting though. Oh no, because you get okay. something Cool. Drinks we're going to Tesco. Okay. Mains. Right. I know you wanted a slush. Wait. Yeah. Drinks we're going to Tesco. Yeah. I know you wanted a slush. Yeah. But you're not getting one. Okay. Why did you just say that? Why did you just say that? Why did you just say that? You're not getting fucked. Not getting <laughs> so we're going to Tesco's for what? A fucking a meal deal, Oasis? No. If you did want a Tango Ice Blast, then we could possibly go and get one. But I thought, dessert you're going to go. I know you're going to go thingy with dessert. Well, Akka. Yeah. <laughs> so I thought... You want the drink like, to not fill me up? Yeah. I get you. Because mains wise, I've got good options. Okay. First one. Why Tesco? What, what the one up there? Yeah. All right. Because I thought, we're just going to go for Staples. Yeah. And that's good, probably a big array there. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like what you'd normally have like with your dinner. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? You don't want a milkshake with your dinner. No, for that. Because it's just going to fill you up. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. We're all ready. We're just in the car. Lily's just gone back upstairs because she's going to get a blanket because we thought, I'm going to take a blanket with us. But right now, we're going to go to um, the garage. Well, Lily, Lily said we're just going to get drinks from Tesco, but we might as well go to the garage that's close because I, I, don't know, I kind of want an ice blast. And I think the garage does ice blasts because I've Googled it. And I think it does, I think. But we'll probably just get another drink as well. And there she is so we're gonna go get a drink now and then we've decided well we we looked at a lot of places didn't we yeah we did we looked at loads. for our main course but it was all just moving mad yeah places like we saw were this, closed that yeah places were closed like you have to sit like you have to be sat at a table outside to get it so we've just decided we're gonna go to the traffic center and you chose archies didn't you yes so we're gonna get archies and i've not had archies in ages and it is good so i'm excited about that and then i've got one of the desserts yes i've got one of the desserts. you won't be able to see it it's in the back she secured the bag i secured one dessert and there is another dessert place but i think if we want if we still want to eat it we can get it on the way home yeah so that's what's going on and then for snacks we decided to abolish the snacks because we're going to be full yeah because we're going to go in for the main aren't we yeah we're going to get burgers chicken mm -hmm. Sides. Okay. Yeah, I was actually Ooh. like, I've just been feeling a bit sad today. Like, I went and had my shower yeah. and I was st stood in the mirror doing my skincare. Like, we're both feeling. I think they're just something, something in, the, in the air. In the air. There's the energy. Off. So 
Oh, this is gonna cheer us up. Yeah. I'm excited. Let's go. We secured the goods. I finally got my ice blast. And this one's mine too. But Lily's got water because she's healthy. So now we're just about to do click and collect. We're at the TC, we're going to get the Archies. We tried to do click and collect, couldn't do it. Oh dear, the person who's part next to me has just come back. Let's go quickly, <laughs> let's go quickly. We're going to get the Archies. <laughs> oh fuck, bye. We need that for a ticket. I know we do. Oh, right, my, my phone God. needs to shut oh. the fuck up. Don't tell me what to do about to so go round and round about. <laughs> It's the biggest hump I've seen in my life. Where that white Ford's going. Oh, off we go. Oh my God, it is busy. Well, I think it'll be all right. Yeah, we're gonna- I hope. We're gonna enjoy it. Oh, ah, it's fucking bumpy. Oh my God, my bell. Oh my God. We got here with 10 minutes. Oh, fuck <laughs> me. That's it. Um, we got here with 10 minutes imagine to spare. Imagine you gave it. So, we went to Archie. The traffic center was fucking heaving. Yeah. I mean, Even. then again, we did decide to go but so on a Saturday. 7 p.m. Prime time. 7 p.m. Like, what's everyone doing? In traffic center. So, <laughs> we got to Archie's big fat queue. Um, and it, we goes, how long is it going to be? And he says, mm, half an hour. That's half an hour from queuing to ordering, not even to get your food yet. So we was like, oh. So then we went to, what was it called? The place? Um, I have I don't even know. I it's basically, no idea, if you know the traffic center, you know the a the Asian food bit. Which is basically like the, a little bit further down from Arches. It's like it's, the street food. Yeah. Oh my God. Can you tell the road? Bumpy. <laughs> <laughs> food is going to be in Jesus bits. Jesus Christ. It's going to be baby food by, so by the time we get there. Anyway, I think, I hope it's going to be okay. All we can do is try. Hello. Yeah. I think it's me now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so just head to Beth, you'll direct you where to go. Okay, thank, thank you. you. Bye. Hi, Beth. The guys are going through the tunnel. <gasps> Should we record it? Hi. Yeah. Follow it round on the other side. There'll be a girl in a high piece directing you where to go. Thank you. So on the scary night, so they have characters. Yeah, and they like <gasps> jump out. Look at it, it's a secret garden. It's a secret garden. Wow. A lot of people will be scared here. Oh, look. It's a oh fire. My God. Put the window down. Hi. Hi. <laughs> she was so cute. I'm so excited. I've never been to one of these. Lily has never watched Dirty Dancing. <gasps> Is that a chicken? That's so freaky. Oh my god, I'm kind of scared. Oh my god, no, it's all right. It's just a tree. <laughs> Hi. <gasps> He's got grapes. Oh my god. Oh my god. Can you take one? Bye. Oh, I thought they were real. Hi. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> was it no! Was it actually? Yes, it's wet. And he's got a fucking he's got a fucking look! The rabbit hole. Look! <laughs> he he had um, a waterproof thing on, you bastard. Oh no, what's going on here? I'm putting my fucking thing up because Lock I'm the doors, not lock this. the doors. Right, when we come to the Did scary one. open the doors? When we come to the scary one, because we're gonna have to book that. You I'm need... not coming to the fucking scary That's one. That's what we need to tune into. It'll say what it on the What does he want screen. from me? He's fuming. He just sprayed me without my consent. Oh my oh, god, guys, you made me ink. Tomorrow they've got Annabelle. I'm not watching Scary Films. I know. If anybody would like to come what and watch What do you do on, on the Scary Did they try and open your doors? Yeah. No, fuck that. You do. Oh my god, I'm upside down. Hold on now. We're here now. Are you ready? And I've just realised my windscreen's actually dirty, so hopefully it rains a little bit so that I can wipe it away. <laughs> but anyway, this Hon is where. Honk your horn! <laughs> <laughs> we live in life so look this is what's going on we're at the drive-in cinema <laughs> so wait hold on what are we supposed to do tune your radio into 87.8 fm is that <gasps> where's the horny folks let's go <laughs> honey, honey, honey. 
Oh my god, it's raining. That's good though, because it's washing my windscreen, but hopefully it's not gonna rain all the way through the field. Oh, she's got a umbrella. She's got her priority straight with umbrella. We didn't bring one. Hot girls don't need umbrellas. Mm. I'm very excited. This is fat, whatever this is. <gasps> That's the noodles. I think I'm gonna put my seat back. Okay, Enjoy well, yourself. Well, this is the food. Look at it raining right now. How crazy. This is our food. We have some bao buns. We have some noodles with some chicken that look unreal. A chicken burger. This apparently is salt and pepper chips. This is, is the most not. diabolical excuse for salt and pepper chips. <laughs> I, want, I almost want to I've seen it in my <laughs> life because it's literally chips with some peppers that and onions. Pepper. There's no salt and pepper. So, geez, don't get the salt and pepper chips from there, but everything else looks good. So we'll fill you in when the movie gets going. <laughs> Happy Sunday! Today, I've actually just been cleaning my bathroom. I've pretty much like done all the cleaning. I'm just mopping the floor now. This mop, floor mopping stuff that I've got smells so good. It's like, I'll try and show you. I think it's just flash, the pink flash with Febreze like blossoms. So nice. And I've put like, um, I've put Zaflora, Midnight Blooms. Hello, do you want to fuggers? I've put this in all the plug holes and down the toilet and yeah and my shower door is now looking nice and clean because i hadn't cleaned it yet but now it's looking cute and i'm not in focus i'm gonna clean and i'll just like fast forward all this so you can enjoy the vibes hopefully it can motivate you to clean i'm trying to get better at cleaning like it's not my forte but it makes me so happy when i do it like afterwards so you can watch <laughs> that a little chicken this angle is not it's not the one but we're in the car and um i still don't know how to put the car tripod up i bought a car tripod and my dash is like very kind of like the windscreen's close to the dash so it won't fit on the windscreen so i think i need to put it on the window i need to put it on the window like the windscreen but I just haven't found a time to do that yet. Cause I'm, I don't, I get, I'm procrastinating. Let's face it, that's what I'm doing. So this angle is not the nicest because you definitely can see right up my nostrils, hoping I don't have any bogeys. But you know what you can see from this angle? You can see my deviated septum. So I can't breathe out of one nostril and it's because of this, cause I've broken my nose twice. I thought I would come and chat to you because I feel like we haven't actually like checked in in a while like I feel like I've been recording a lot of stuff but I don't know what I've been recording like we actually haven't checked in in a while so hi I've been living in Manchester now for like what two weeks over two weeks two weeks and a few days two and a half weeks I don't know two and a half weeks I guess um and I'm not gonna lie like I'm super happy I'm super happy. I really like it. Oh my god. I don't like the traffic though. There's fucking traffic everywhere. People are just selfish, you know, because what are you doing? You was behind me. How the fuck does this work? I don't like it one little bit. Okay, there we go. Um, 
So I'm just on my way to pick up my meal preps at the moment. I'm trying this place out called Wham Kitchen. I don't know if you guys have heard of it. Uh, it's in Crumpsall. And I got good, people told me it was good. Um, my neighbor said it was good that I should try there because I basically get meal preps. You guys know this. I get meal preps for my dinners. And um, the place that I was using in Preston, obviously it was in Preston. But I think they actually do uh, nationwide delivery, but I'm just not organized like that. I need somewhere where I can go and pick it up. So I'm going to try it today. Oh my God, all right, Amber Light. <gasps> okay. I'm going to pick it up today. This will be the first time trying it. What is sending me though is I've got to go today. Today's Monday to get two. And then Wednesday, I've got to go back to get another three for like, because I'm getting five meal preps like for the week, like for Monday to Friday. That's a little bit annoying to me because I'd rather just pick them all up. So I might ask if I can just do that in future. I, pr I know it's because they're like fresh, but I kind of ain't got time and petrol like that. Do you know what I mean? This morning I've been filming some content to Rooney, content to Rooney, some um, sponsored posts. So it's cute. I feel like I've, I feel a lot more like happy with like the content I'm making. I feel happy to make content. Like I just I feel like because my surrounding is like nicer and like happier and healthier for me the lighting is way better and it just makes me happy to make content so that's what's been going on there's honestly not much has been going on people keep me like it's like what's going on i'm like nothing like i'm just genuinely happy i had like i don't know i do genuinely feel like a lot lighter like just mentally i don't feel like a lot of the days where I woke up in my old flat, I don't know, I think there was a combination of things. It wasn't like just that flat. It was like, I wasn't seeing like my friends really because they all lived in, like in Manchester. Um, I I was just kind of like waking up and thinking, oh my God, I'm just like, like dreading the day. I don't know why, but like I don't feel that way anymore, especially since moving here. And I just think, I feel very hopeful about life this week i'm actually embarking on trying to stay off socials a lot so i'm trying to like stay off socials all through the day as best as i can and then i'm not going cold turkey cold turkey because i thought that's like that's pretty drastic i don't know if i could do that um, and then when i fail i'll be mad at myself so i feel like i'm just trying to stay off socials in the day and then at night time go on for a couple hours or whatever um because i'm really just trying to i feel like when you have when you're busy like you have a job and you're busy all the time i don't know for some people social media might be like a release like when they get home from work and they should chill out but because it's my job as well there's so many like emotions and feelings tied to social media especially like rooted in like your worth and stuff a lot of stuff that i've like worked through in therapy um and yeah, it's a deep, that's a deep topic. <laughs> that's a deep topic. If we ever want to talk about that one one day, let me know and we can talk about like how you can, social media can literally get the better of you and you can put your whole entire worth as a person into validation of others and that kind of stuff. Deep. But um, I feel like for me, I was realizing like you can spend hours and hours and hours on social media doing nothing and I was like I've got this time and I'm just wasting my not wasting my time but like aimlessly scrolling away my time that I could be using to do other things and like a few weeks ago I stumbled across like some like videos about like spirituality and just like raising your vibration and shit like that and I really wanted to embark on raising my vibration because i feel like oh my god i don't even know if i told you guys this but i went to see a psychic i didn't film it or anything like that because i wanted it to be personal but i went to see this psychic and we talked about loads of stuff and um she read my cards and a lot of stuff well she's not like i don't know if you call it like a psychic i don't know what you would call it really like a clairvoyant uh i don't know like a clairvoyant like I don't know but she was amazing she was absolutely amazing and she's more so just like a very spiritual person that can has is very in tune with her intuition and the thing is i feel like i have a lot of intuition it's just sometimes i don't trust myself and i don't like my vibration is not to some of you oh i feel like i sound some of you are gonna look at me and think what the fuck is this bitch talking about right now but the people that get it get it right and i feel like um i just need to raise my vibration so i can be more in tune with my intuition and spiritual side and that kind of shit yeah so um i really wanted to be mindful with my time so like this morning i had therapy 
and then um, I did some breathing exercises and then like usually I'd be like sitting scrolling on social media doing absolutely fucking nothing but I decided today I was going to start a book so I've started this book by Deepak Chopra Deepak Deepak Chopra is that his name I'm I'm not sure and it's called you are the universe so I'm starting to read that and I just want to you know you know how the vibes are guys I just want to be more mindful in this crazy crazy world we can just days just pass us by like the time that just goes and if you don't spend it wisely or spend it doing the things that make you happy or bring you fulfillment and enjoyment then it can all just fucking slip right under you and you don't even know it's happening so that's what I'm doing at the moment hopefully it's gonna bring me some happiness and inner peace and joy and I feel good because it's like I'm doing this at a time I feel like a lot of the time people seek out this kind of thing or seek out God or seek out some sort of like help from the universe when they're in a bad place and they need help and that's not like that's not, I'm not slating anyone that does that I do that like um, it happens but I think there's something quite special in seeking that out when you are in a good place mentally as well and just like really working to bring yourself some inner peace wow deep oh my god it's monday we're getting deep that's what's going on with me at the moment i do feel happy i feel like i just i feel i feel hopeful i feel like lighter as a person i feel like it's been a new start a fresh beginning so yeah that's what's happening and it also makes me like really fulfilled to like do work and like do work that i'm proud of and i think oh that looks really good and like the brands that i'm working with like it and yeah so now i just like after i've got my this i've got quite a lot of sponsored work on at the moment so once i get my sponsored work done i feel like i can what is wrong with you two i feel like i can then focus on like my org more organic I feel like at the moment with my YouTube, like, I feel like I'm doing well with my YouTube. Um, like, you know, doing my vlogs and stuff and you guys are enjoying it and that makes me happy. But at the same time, I also wanna make other videos. So when I've got, when I've got certain things situated, then I can focus on what's next, you know? On um, the kind of content that I wanna make on TikTok, on Instagram, on YouTube, that kind of stuff. I went to the service station the other day, filled up with petrol and they had Kinder Bueno white kinder bueno coconut so it's basically like kin white kinder bueno but with coconut well duh emma but i had to buy it was two, it was all right it was like two for something something so i bought one for me and lily and i it's been staring at me i'm not gonna lie it's been staring at me so i decided to eat one of the fingers before and it was just exactly as i thought it's kind of you know what it is oh my god do you know what it is it's a fucking raffaello that's what it is dressed up as a kinder bueno but I love it. Either way, it was delicious. I would recommend it to everyone. Guess what's on my face right now? A full face of Collection Cosmetics. Do you remember Cos Collection? Collection was like the first ever makeup that I ever got when I was a teenager. And I'm I'm loving this face. The foundation's amazing. The concealer's amazing. Well, everyone always knew the concealer was amazing. But I'm reiterating it. I had this little... Um, con it's like a bronzer blush and highlighter palette beautiful really pigmented really pretty blends nicely everything was fantabulous the liquid lips are nice everything's fabulous i'm very happy i feel like i'm living in my purpose you know what i'm saying so i'm gonna go pick my meal preps up hopefully they're gonna be good i think they will be i think i have a good feeling but i'll show you guys when i get them I'll show you when we get there. Just in traffic ATM. Went past Tim Hortons and I didn't stop for a coffee. That's what we call self-control. Right, see ya. Okay, maybe I have stopped at Tim Hortons to get a coffee. And they have something new called a vanilla cream cold brew. So we're gonna try it together. I got my meal prep. I'll show you when I get home. The people in there are so nice. Oh, I'm on low battery. But when I get it, I'll show it to you. Oh my god, I literally, I've just, I'm um, like coming past Tim Hortons, I was like, why the hell are people sat inside? Then I remembered, today is the day that you are allowed to eat inside. Can I get my words out? Today's the day you're allowed to eat inside. Wild. Oh my days, as if I forgot about that. Oh my god, so that means this week I can go to a cafe and work in a cafe or do something nice that I like to do. This is the drink. For some reason I thought it would have a cold foam. Did it say vanilla foam? I don't even know what it said. But 
this is it and it's a cold brew but I'm guessing with vanilla milk vanilla see I don't really like sweet 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 fluffy but let's see how sweet this is this is a drink let's do it oh it's sweet oh it's sweet it's good though it's good let's not lie to ourselves it's good I should have just got the regular cold brew but I fancy just going all out today so it's good but it's sweet so if you like sweet then great for some reason i've got it in my head that like i'm like oh i hate sweet i used to have vanilla latte vanilla ice latte all the time I, that was my go-to and then i just started not getting the vanilla and now when i have a sweet coffee i'm like oh because i don't put sugar in my coffee. wow i don't put sugar in my hot coffee or my hot tea or anything like that so i think i'm just not used to it i'm not gonna lie i'm hungry i've already scrammed one of my meal preps but it was tuna pasta salad it's good these are my other ones. So that's like steak with hummus and veggies. Or is that sweet potato fry? Oh my God, I thought you... That sweet potato fry is that. Today's a good day. So that's steak, sweet potato fries and hummus and veggies. This looks like white rice, veggies and chicken and like sweet chilli. Mmm. I'm loving this tuna pasta salad. I've not had tuna pasta salad for a very long time. And it's, yeah. Okay, so we went to this brand new restaurant called American Pies the other day and I just have little bits of footage from it. So this is a bit random, but I wanted to show you guys because if you're in Manchester, you can go. It was so, so, so good. Oh my God. How hot is it? Oh, it's hot. Oh, my God. We got chicken palm and garlic nuts. Oh my God. Why is this so exciting? We're gonna do rock, paper, scissors to see what dessert we're gonna get. I want the brownie pie. <laughs> Which one's the brownie pie? The Biscoff brownie pie. Oh, that's what I wanted. Yeah, let's get that. Okay. Woohoo. Oh my god. We got it. Biscoff brownie pie. Unreal. Okay, I don't know why this vlog took me so long to edit. I'm literally so tired right now. I'm gonna go to bed right now. But again, I forgot to end the vlog. I feel like this is the last like chaotic vlog. Not the last chaotic vlog, but the last one for a while because I feel like I finally settled in all the footage that I have is now edited because before I was just filming aimlessly and like putting it together and stuff. All the footage I had is now edited. So I feel like it's going to be a lot calmer. The videos are going to be more structured going forward. But this vlog did crack me up when I was um, editing it because we had fun, especially at the drive-in cinema. So everywhere that I've been, places that I've been, things that I mentioned will be down in the description box along with my HelloFresh code. Don't forget to go down there, check out HelloFresh. You guys know how much I love it. If you, Especially if you follow me on Instagram, you've seen the recipes that I chef up. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you if you made it this far. This one was a longer vlog. Hope you enjoyed that. So I'll see you soon. Love you guys so much. Mwah.